It's Capcun, one anti gamer. <laughs> what is up, guys? Capcun here, and I'm bringing you guys some more Black Ops 2. Looky, looky, and it's some hard point on actually. I believe this is actually league play. So this was some qualifying matches that I did actually a couple days ago. It's pretty good gameplay, though. There's some instances in this gameplay you're gonna laugh, um, but. To be honest, it was recorded in theater mode, so if it looks like I'm not shooting them, I am shooting them, okay? Um, but anyways, I wanted to talk about, I guess, the whole Xbox and Xbox One and PlayStation 4 thing because, you know, I talked about in the past that I was going to go with the PlayStation 4. I already have money down on the PlayStation 4, and I'm really... I can't wait for them to come out because right now I just don't have the money to buy a gaming laptop because that's probably what I would do. I probably wouldn't buy a desktop because I just, I don't know, I don't like sitting at the, I don't know, it's something about it. I, I just don't, it's like the feel or atmosphere, but I like just sitting on a couch, chilling, you know, having my laptop sitting next to me where I can watch a TV and, you know, whatnot, but as far as, you know, the systems... Uh, I can't wait for them to come out, you know, I, I know a lot of people can't wait for them to come out and uh, have some fun and play on, uh, you know, some new games because shit, most of these games are just totally outdated graphic wise, but now with, you know, the release of Call of Duty Ghosts and seeing all this gameplay, you're just like, is this next gen, you know, is, is this next gen? And you're looking at like, uh, this doesn't look that much better than what we already have. I, Granted, I'm sure it's going to look slightly better, of course. And, uh, you know, Call of Duty Ghost doesn't look too bad. But at the same time, I was hoping a lot more. I, I said that before. Um, I was just hoping for a new overhaul completely on that game. But we're just like, just remake COD 4. Fuck. Uh, but, you know, I really do want more than COD 4. I mean, there's tons of shit wrong with that game, too. But, you know, nobody, nobody brings that up, so... Uh, but anyways, that's not this uh, topic. Uh, I, that could be a later video. But um, as far as, you know, <clears throat> Xbox One and what you get with it now, it's like, you know, I, I said that I was going to go with the PlayStation 4 because, you know, I'm familiar with the controller. I like the concept. We have a new interface on the PS4. Um, there's a lot of things that is just I really like about it. But the game selection, the game selection, come on. The number one thing, okay, <clears throat> I could care less about fucking watching movies on my PlayStation or my Xbox or listening to music. I don't do it. I don't do it. And I play video games all the time. Like, I play games all the time. I play, I'd say, maybe like two to four hours almost every day, at least. Um, but, you know, there's days when I just don't play at all. I mean, there's days and weeks that I don't play. Shit, there was like a month that I didn't play, you know, and then I'll get back on and I'll play, you know. Um, maybe have a few games. But, you know, I'm not like crazy about it like I used to be, but I still play. But I don't use it for mu uh, movies or listening to music. Now, I might with the PlayStation 4 or Xbox One uh, because you can actually listen to music and play games at the same time, supposedly, which will be fucking awesome. Um... Try not to cuss anymore, but hopefully you guys are doing great. Um, this gameplay is a little bit of hard point, by the way, so keep that in mind. I really don't play hard point too much. I'm a domination guy. That's what I play. Um, and this guy with the riot shield killed me twice in this gameplay. It's freaking funny. Um, but anyways, back on topic. The Xbox One Titanfall, okay? Titanfall uh, is only on Xbox One and PC. I think it comes out later on PlayStation 4, they said. But that's the thing. It's coming out on Xbox One first, you know. Um, you know, it, it, that game looks good, but at the same time, I don't know if that game is going to be for me because it seems like you're going to have to be moving constantly. I mean, doing things constantly. And um, just, you know, playing only with one hand, that kind of gets a little too much for me. So I probably wouldn't be at the, you know, the greatest at that game. Um, cause I need a camp. <laughs> I'm not afraid to admit it. But, um, as far as like, uh, you know, Xbox One and the exclusives, Xbox has got 
Call of Duty Ghosts, like, freaking wrapped around. Like, it's freaking... They're, like, intertwined. You know, they're just... <laughs> it's crazy. So, Call of Duty Ghosts is going to have dedicated servers on the Xbox One. Now, is that going to make a big difference? Like, are you going to notice it? That's the question, you know? Is it going to be a huge change or is it not? Because PlayStation 4, I guess, is not going to have dedicated servers, but yet it's going to be coming out. You know, I think it's announced November 15th. So I guess we're going to get um, our, our, you know, we're going to get uh, our systems before, I guess, this game comes out, Call of Duty Ghosts, I guess. Uh, so, um, yeah, yeah. So I really want to know if I really should just get both. I, I guess I should get both because, um, one, I already got money down on you know, on the PS4, I guess I could change it to the Xbox One, but here's the thing, here's the thing. Um, one big reason why I like playing on the Xbox now is because the controller, um, I have, like, the triggers changed. So, um, one, it needs to have custom button remapping on most of these games that are coming out. I don't know why it doesn't, but I guess it's not going to, you know. Of course, they don't want to, you know, add that in there, um, but... I'm going to need uh, my controller uh, changed up. I, I'm going to have to do a custom, you know, button swap on it. I'm going to have to send it to somebody or do it myself, one of the two. But um, I probably won't do it myself because I really don't know what I'm doing. But um, it's probably not hard. Uh, but the controller, I'm going to have to have, you know, the buttons changed if I'm going to really, really be good on Xbox One. Um, unless you could use your Xbox 360 controller on the Xbox One, but I highly doubt you can. But who knows? Maybe you can. Nobody know. I don't know if they uh, announced that or not or talked about that. Um, but that that would be really interesting to know. Um, and yeah, uh, that would be cool too because you know I wouldn't mind just using the regular PS3 controller, even though uh, I mean, what's well, got the touchpad and that fucking light on it? I don't need that shit. But um, you know, overall, I can't wait for them to come out, um, but I'm really thinking about, you know, getting an Xbox One now because of all these exclusives, and uh, the only big exclusive I'm really interested on PS4 is Killzone, of course. I mean, Killzone looks great, and I want to definitely play on that. So, you know, I really want to play on both of them, you know, just for the exclusives, but at the same time, I don't want to buy two systems and be like, well, shit, I'm not going to play this one for a very long time. I mean, I guess I could sell it, but at the same time, I mean, you're, you're spending that money. I mean, it's stupid. You're dumb for getting rid of your shit. But, uh, yeah, that's, uh, I guess, I don't know what you would call this commentary or rant. I really don't know. I just wanted to speak my mind. It's a bunch of gibberish going on in there. And uh, I really had something planned out for today, but uh, I just didn't really want to do that video. I, I was going to do, like, um, Topic Tuesdays or something like that where I talked about like something from the news like there was some dog that got blew up fucking crazy people out there guys crazy ass motherfuckers and um you know just just some stuff you know in the news i could talk about i don't know what you guys think about that um the nintendo 64 is getting put on hold right now i have it but something happened i i, I don't know it just doesn't turn on maybe i got a bunk ass system it worked for a while i played goldeneye and everything it was great but uh, it, it took the shit. So uh, anyways, thanks for watching. I'll talk about it later. Capkin out.